What's up, sweetie pies? My name is Cake Game Lady, and welcome to From Ivan. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, and you like to see more content when it arrives, then please click on the subscribe button below, or click on that little bell that will let you know when I upload more videos. Well, I found this on Ichio recently, and it's all about me being an HR manager, and my only job is to send out, like, cards, like, greeting cards to people based on situations, such as birthdays and weddings and everything like that. Of course, if this is real life, you have to be concerned about hiring, firing, trying to resolve problems between the bosses and the employees and everything else, and look into incidents that might drop the employer morale and everything else. But I'm really excited to see what's going to happen in this game, so I'm going to get started, shall we? Hey, here you go. Let me grab my mouse and start. Okay, New Year's. Okay, first day at MCT. Dad's birthday is on the 11th, Mia shower is on the 19th, and Artemis's, or is that, yeah, Artemis's graduation. Okay. So, here we go. Alrighty, hello Ivan, welcome to Agricultural Softworks Department, ASD. We look forward to your tenure as a human resource manager of this vital branch of Ministry of Computer Technology. As HRM, you are ASD's first, last, and only defense against low worker morale. Wow, really? Cost MCT thousands of lost man hours every quarter. Are they kidding me? I'm like the only one here? To stop LLM at ASD for causing LHM at MCT. I hate these abbreviations. The HRM is authorized to present workers with cards of appreciation on real days of significance cards. Okay. By giving our workers a fleeting acknowledgement of their individual personhood. Alright. The cards have the power to stop LWM dead in its tracks. Use the cards wisely. Use them well, or you will be replaced by someone who can. Good luck on your first day. Sincerely, Andre Markov, Branch Operations Superior Supervisor Boss. That's a nice one. Just say boss. From the desk of this, this. Jeez, I'm like the only, you know, human resource manager here. And I have to use cards. To HRM, previous one. Hello, Ivan. Your first task as HRM is to ensure the peaceful departure of your predecessor, ex HRM Sasha Protova. Ex HRM Protova served the MCT with distinction for 40 years, but a slight dip in her overall productivity score mandated her swift replacement by you. Message contains. So she worked here for 40 years? It is vital that ex HRM feels a sense of pride and accomplishment before she is escorted from the building today. She doesn't even know if she's going. Please present her with appropriate cards at your earliest convenience. Sincerely, Andre Markov. Isn't this your thing though? You're the one that's giving her the pink slip. Let's see, red shift. Okay, the season's hottest radio telescopes. Uh, greetings neighbor, so this is embarrassing. You're probably wondering where the heck is my January issue of Redshift? Well, your space cadet neighbor, I am me, Natasha, hello by the way, got your copy in the mail almost a month ago and just assumed they sent her to by accident. Surely they had her like the name on the back. I hope you can forgive me for the slow return of your beloved space periodical. By the way, there's a great article on page 3 on page 53 about the latest findings from the BTA-6, your neighbor Natasha. Okay, that's nice and all. Wow, I got a lot of stuff. Choose a birthday card for dad, select the fair roll card for the previous arch HR manager, picked out a card to thank Natasha. Okay. Select the thank you card. Traditional thank you card, unconventional. I'm all out of thank you cards, so how about a wow. And your knowledge is kindness out of this world. You are super de duper appreciated. How about this one? Your kindness is out of this world. After all, it's space related and she likes the space thing. Thanks from planet Earth. I like that one. Okay, choose a birthday card. Uh, traditional happy bur happy birthday. Okay. Uh, one, two. Wow. And age is just a number. Or a cheerful birthday. Another day older, another day wiser. Uh, let's see. What should I pick for him? Uh, age is just a number. How about this one? Um, so happy to the wisest man I know. I like that one. 
Okay, send a farewell thing. See the traditional one. Good luck in your f what? In inspirational and we'll never forget you. Your life in venture by you. Okay, how about this one? We'll never forget you. I like that one better. At least if I was like going away or being fired or such. I like a nice card like that. Thanks for all the memories. It's better than just sending her an unconventional one. A one world! I'm done with the whole week? That was quick. Okay, thanks for the card. Not bad for your first dumb pick. Cute, funny, but not too funny. I can tell you got an eye for a card that makes the recipient feel good. For better or for worse. Anyway, I'm just trying to say no hard feelings about, about taking my job. Well, thank you so much. When they told me I was getting the chop, I was pretty ticked. But after a long hot shower and half a bottle of vodka, well, that definitely cures everything, I realized I wasn't angry at them, I was angry at me. See, 40 years ago, 40 long, long years ago, I had a choice hitchhiking to St. Petersburg to try out for a ballet. Or take the job my uncle got me at, you know. I made the smart choice. The safe choice. And I'll never forgive myself for it. Yep. Look, someday you're gonna wake up and you'll be O-L-D. Old. Yep, that's the truth. After 40 years and all. And all you'll have is memories of who you are right now. So if you want to slug out cards for the company, then be my guest. But if it means you're going to be holding out on some opportunities that you're too scared to chase, well, either take it or leave it. Playing it safe is the easiest thing to do. Remember that, kid. Good luck, Sasha Petrova, former HMO. Thank you, miss. Okay, so, performance evaluation. Hello, Ivan. This is your first week attending to your new duties as HRM. Your performance has been monitored and evaluated, while your choice of cars was not the most conventionally appropriate selection. Have you seen those cars? They were horrible. It has been deemed acceptable alternative. Perhaps cards will bring ex-HRM Petrova comfort during a transitory period and reduce any lingering resentment she might feel towards her former employer. In other words, you want her to be happy towards her ex-boss. This performance evaluation is a reminder you serve as a vital function at ASD of MCT, so you show that distributing appropriate cars over a period of time has a significant impact on the mood, productivity, and the long-term outcomes of everyone within the center circle of influence. Do not take this responsibility lightly. Sincerely, your boss. Thank you. Of course, that was so poor, the, com the company being mad at me for sending out good cards. How in the world was that bad? You're invited to the annual Orloff Orloff, I hope I'm saying that right, family reunion, February 24th to the 30th. Hi, Ivan. I hope to see you there. Artem. Oh, it's not Artemis. My bad. Hey, kiddo. Thanks again for coming over last week. You and your mom cooked one hell of a, I hope I'm saying that right, birthday dinner. Love the car, too. You know how to butter up your old man. I think it's going to be one good year for me. Things are going well, and I'm settled into a good routine. No reason to rock the boat on this point. I hope we didn't talk your ear off too much about your sister. You know she's pretty lonely up on that space station. You really should write to her sometime. Speaking of space, I saw this ad in Redshift and I thought of you. Take a look. Oh uh, look, Professor Olaf. Oh, he's, he works at the university! Isn't that cool? Remember that trip we took to London Museum of Cosmonautics? Back when you were a kid, you cried so hard when we had to leave. I had to bribe you with that toy telescope from the gift shop just to get you out of the door. Whatever happened to that thing? I don't know. I don't know myself. Anywho, I know you just started a new job, but opportunities like that don't come along for all that often. You should go for it. Take a chance once. I think you do a pretty decent job. Love, Dad. P.S. Did you get the invitation to the reunion? Looking forward to it. Don't forget to put in for that week off. Okay, it was the 24th. Reach for the stars. Are you crazy for the cosmos? Spacey for space race? Then you might have the right staff to become a docent, deep, whatever, at the London Museum of Cosmonautics. Learn valuable public speaking and communication skills. Teach the cosmonauts of tomorrow. Give guided tours of the 
I can't read this. Martian landing module. Now accepting applications. Don't forget this once in a light year opportunity. This sounds a lot better than being an HR manager at a bad company. Hello, Ivan. I just want to let you know I appreciate the card. I know it's strange to say, but I'm feeling really energized all week. I think it has something to do with it. It's probably that card I sent her. So thank you for thinking of me. Any chance you know a good spot to watch a meteor shower? I usually sneak up on the roof, but last month when I got up there for a look at the... I can't grommets? I got a good look at my landlord with his mistress canoodling instead. Ew. Needless to say, the roof access has been chained up tight ever since. Which I think might be against the code? I think so. Anyway, there's gonna be a great view of the Quantrids, I think that says, on Saturday, and I hate to miss two in a row. Any tip for a fellow red shifter would be much appreciated. Well, that's nice. I definitely love the letter. Okay, what is this? Anguish bathroom sobbing source. Discovered, actual required. Hello, Ivan. We have determined the cause of anguish sobbing that has been echoed through the building for the last four hours. No one bothered to look who it is? They waited for four hours? It appears that the junior systems analyst Bo Bogdan Jeremoff was recently notified of the untimely passing of his pet cockatoo baby. Aww, that's sad. That just contains. Please deploy a car to consult SJA Veramoff in this trying time. If his grief causes further delay in his work, he will be replaced. So make your choice wisely. Sincerely, your boss. Jeez, that's sad. But I'm getting a lot of nice things from a cubicle. Okay, select a cockatoo condolence. While these are all okay, I don't know about this one. Bye bye, birdie. I mean, he'd probably cry about that. Uh, cockatoos teach our hearts to soul. Um, and wishing you peace. Which one's a good one for your pet cockatoo, especially after his passing? Well, usually this is a traditional one. At least this one's way better than the ones before. Hmm, which one should I choose? How about this one? Uh, this is for a deceased cockatoo. Sending you condolences to you and your flock. Okay. I hope that one's good. Uh, pick out invitation for the thing. Oh, this one's good. Party time. Okay. What's one say? Not that one. Uh, it's a meteor shower. <laughs> that one's cute, but not the right one. And... I can't really read that one. But it does look pretty. Uh, not that one. I mean, it's too cursive. I can't even read it. At least this one, it gets to the point. I like that one. Okay, got that one. And choose a stamp for the application. Ooh, now this will be good. I gotta pick the good one. How about this one? Um, it's a rocket. Or this one. Um, I'll take this one. Okay, so... Yep, yeah, Baby's Memorial. And that's sweet of him. Meteor Shower. Hopefully I picked the right ones. Uh, dear Ivan, thank you so much for sending me such a lovely card. Baby really did teach my heart how to soar. I wish I had gotten to meet her. I'm sure you two would hit it off. Doesn't she look majestic in this picture? Please tell Mr. Markov that I'll be back in the office the day after tomorrow. Sincerely, Bogdan. Aw, that's sweet. I love the picture. Okay, your time off request for the week of 25th has been received. It is, Its status is under review. Isn't that for my family reunion? Okay, Redshift. Uh, hey you, got your Redshift in the mail again. I'm starting to think you're letting them screw up so you can't have an excuse to talk to me. Thanks again for inventing me to the meteor shower party. I had a great time talking with you, even though you're objectively wrong about Russia's greatest astronomer. I mean, come on. Nikolai Chernov? I don't know. Does Nikolai, you know, have a crater on the moon named after him? Fyodor Bright <laughs> All the way. Let's hang out again soon, okay? I'm eager to settle this bait one for all. That night. Ah, she's letting me use her nickname. 
Hey kiddo, don't forget about cousin Artem's kindergarten graduation this week. Graduation? Isn't that cool? If you don't send a card, your uncle will never let me hear the end of it. Love, Dad. P.S. Have you talked any more to that cute neighbor girl you were telling us about? Tick tock, Ivan. Don't be shy. Of course. P.P.S. You're a really special guy, and any girl will be lucky to have you. Aw, thanks, Dad. Okay, see. Subject action required. Urgent directive from branch operations. Okay, hello, Ivan. Due to his undying devotion and workplace productivity, the boss is unable to find time to secure cards for his wife to denote their 10th marriage anniversary today. So you didn't get her a card? That's a... That's, ba that's bad. He should get her some flowers. Every girl loves flowers. Unless they're allergic, then you have to do something else. It is vital to the ASD operations that the boss's sacred union remain blissful and intact. Please select appropriate romantic cards for boss to deploy tonight on his dinner date. Your discretion in this matter is mandatory. Of course, it comes from the boss. He can't even do it himself. Pick out a nice card. Okay. Pick out a nice graduation thing. Okay, so congratulations. That's standard. Uh, congratulations. Okay. I don't like that. The future is yours. Inspirational and goofy one. I'm stinking proud of you. Well, they're in kindergarten, so that is cute. I love that. I'm so stinking proud of you. It's cheesy, but it's true. Okay, anniversary card for the boss. Traditional one. Happy 10th anniversary to my one true love. Okay. At least that's good. For this anniversary, how about a menage a trois? Are you kidding me? No. Uh, every day with you is an adventure. At least that's sweet and heartfelt. Loving you always. Hmm. Okay, this one's heartfelt. This one's adventurous. And I always like heartfelt ones. For better or for for. Okay. Hopefully that one's good. Pick a spot to bring to Natasha. Oh, jeez. I gotta choose for my date? Um. I don't even know much about her. Um, no. No, a psychic? Uh, that would be nice. Or, well, for one thing, well, going to a restaurant's good. I don't know if she likes American food. I don't know for sure. Plus, psychics? Are you kidding me? And book gazing. Well, I know she knows a lot about astronomy and everything else. I don't know about that book gazing thing. But a picnic at the park is sounds lovely. I definitely would love to do that. So, this one. Alrighty, so another week. But still. How about the family reunion? I mean, it ends at the 30th, but still. So, what, what's this? Okay, dear Ivan, congratulations! Your application to our recent program has been reviewed and you have advanced to the next phase of the selection process. For round two, we like to get to our, know our applicants a little better, which is why we're asking you to write a personal essay on the following questions. What is your favorite spacecraft and why? And yes, it can be a fictional spacecraft. Let's see, judging? From your taste as damn I'm assuming you're a sci-fi fan. Well, that's definitely true. Uh, I'll say it must be postmarked no later than the February 15th. Good luck and happy writing. Sincerely, Abigail Addington. Isn't that cool? At least I, you know, pat. Oh, jeez. Great, I just missed that. And please send the uh, car to STW Injured Wheat Thresher Hardware technician as new address okay so Yuri Yemelin CEO severe gruesome injury ward oh my god are you kidding me we're gonna have a lawsuit city clinical hospital number 67 Yudasa Saima Daya Moscow Russia shoot I didn't even see what was the first one hi honey the diners is called ooh she called me honey I'm guessing we're really into this aren't we which means I have to cancel dinner in a documentary night. 
Ugh, I hate this stupid job. Here's an idea. How about a late dinner at my place? I can swipe some... I don't know how, what that, how to say that. From work. We can curl up on the couch with some wine. Or we can skip dinner and go straight for the dessert. Ooh, Natasha. Oh my god, I can't believe I just wrote that. <laughs> uh, hello, Ivan. Thank you for your discretion with the boss's um 10th wedding anniversary, you know, covert cars deployment. I'm happy to report your art selection was a complete success. I don't know how you surmise that Mrs. Um, Markatov loves both borscht and terrible puns, but kudos on your intelligence gathering. Please accept this inner office memo as a token of my thanks. Thank you. Oh, look at this! Uncle Ian, your card was so cute! I like the stinky cheese very much. Say cheese! Aw, oh, Arno. That's sweet. But where, where can I look at my notes? Shoot. Um, I didn't read what the first one said. Okay. Okay, which one should I pick for the injured wheat technician, Yuri? Um, better be... Get barrel soon. Ironic. Never give up. You are the best. Well, hmm. I like this one. Get well soon. Well, which one should I get? Get well soon. Ironic. Uh, never give up or cheer up. I like this one. I mean, I it doesn't say what he was injured from. I'm guessing the from dealing with wheat. It's he is a weak technician, but. All it says, it doesn't say anything. I hope it, he didn't get hit by bees or something. We miss you back at the hive. I hope he likes that one. Because I hate, you know, picking a terrible one for nothing. Pick a tie for dinner with Nat. Hmm. Well, this one is, you know, normal, which is good. I have no idea what in the world this is. What in the world would you call that? I really want to know, please. If anyone knows what this is, please tell me. And while a bow tie is good, after all, I am going on a date. But I love this one, the planet one. After all, we're both lovers of, you know, astronomy and everything. Okay, choose a font for the planetarium essay. Shoot! Mm! Well, for one thing, Sans is out of the question. Hmm. New time and the times, you know, New Russian is like the default one. Ivanhan, well, it does look, you know, better than, you know, the normal and way better than this. I still don't know. And the Pretentia Nueve, it looks a bit sciencey, but I don't know if they'll let me, you know, use that or not. After all, it depends on what kind of font you use. I know a lot of people don't like the papyrus font, especially when it comes to essays and such. But will it matter if I choose something other than a Times New Russian? I mean, what if they think I'm like really boring enough because of that? Okay, which one should I pick for, you know, the essay? Well, for all these, I think I go with the default because I don't know about these four. I mean, well, it's a good idea to change things up a bit. It's always, you know, reassuring to know what would happen, so let me do this. After all, they want me to write essay, so I don't want to, you know, risk something up. Okay. Date night. Boss day. Boss day? Really? And vacation. Oh yeah, we're in February. Oh, I am such an id. Okay, dear Ivan, thank you for submitting your personal essay. It has been received and will be processed shortly. We'll let you know our final decision very soon. In the meantime, keep watching the stars. Sincerely, Abigail Addenden. Okay, HR manager, I regret to inform you that my husband, Yuri Yemelin, has passed away after succumbing to his workplace injuries. He died? Oh my god! Thank you for your card. I hope, certainly hope your office will be, be better about protecting their workers from horrific accidents in the future. They didn't tell me it was that, you know, serious! And please let the Hive know that his clone casket funeral is this Saturday, should they care to attend. Ah, uh, criminy, we upset the widow. Anna Yemelin. I didn't realize it was that serious! Greetings from space. Thank you for sending your letter. I read up every book up to cover, and there's only so many quizzes a girl can take. It helps to hear all the juicy gossip back home. Speaking of which, I'm so happy that you're applying for the job in London. 
Haha. <laughs> Remember when you cried like a baby till dad took you to a gift shop? You were born to work in that place, you big nerd. Also, this Natasha girl sounds fantastic. Anyone who name drops Fidior is good in my book. You gotta tell her you're applying for that job, though, dummy. I know it's an awkward conversation, but good relationships are built on honesty. Just look at me and... I don't know how to say it. Anyway, this is from my sister. It's nice to get a letter from her. Anyway, I can't see you and your new lady at the Orloff family reunion. I've been saying all my best stories to embarrass you with. With love from space. P.S. Oh, you might want to take the train home today. Looks like a lot of traffic from up here. <laughs> I like that. Okay, welcome new wheat thresher hardware technician. Are they kidding me this soon? Excellent news! After exhaustive search, we have found our new senior wheat thresher hardware technician. Please send a warm welcoming card to Elena Trodenkov. Kova. Okay, please note it is vital that ASD workers refrain from telling her about a processor's untimely departure and unfortunate demise. Really? Seriously? We had enough trouble filling this post as is. Branch operations appreciate your mandatory accomplice in this matter. I love how they put mandatory in parentheses. What a jerk. The official Federation rulebook. Hi, here's your copy of the official Chess Federation rulebook. It, if you turn to page 16, you'll find that last night you were in fact totally wrong. Impassant may only be played immediately after a pawn advances two squares or the right to capture and passing is lost. The next time you feel like starting a huge pointless fight over instant gay chess, maybe with your next girlfriend, please get your facts straight first. <sighs> Great. I'm having a fight with Natasha. What in the world's with this? Okay, choose a welcome card for a new co-worker. Mm -hmm. Um, new employee. Welcome to the nut house. It definitely feels like that. Welcome to the team and warm welcome. Salutation. This seems good. After all, she's starting a new job. She's probably nervous and she wants to know more about the guy, but of course he died and that's bad enough. Wishing you our warmest welcome. Okay, apology good for Natasha. You better apologize. Um, let's see. Flowers, apology fish, opera tickets, or chocolates. Oh, she. This is tough. I don't even know much about her. It was if it was face related, yes, but I don't know what to get her. Flowers are something, but I don't know if she's allergic. She can't be allergic to fish. That's for sure. Opera tickets. I don't know if she likes opera. I don't know if she likes chocolates or allergic to them. So I might as well go with the, you know, the basic gifts. Flowers. They look pretty enough. Hope she likes them. Okay, Memorial. Jeez, that was bad enough. Boss Day. And what is Boss Day? Okay, hello Ivan. Your time off request for the week of February 25th has been reviewed. Your request is denied. Are they kidding me? Are you kidding me? My request is denied. Then what in the world's the point of working here? Hi, honey. So looking forward to Valentine's Day. I can't believe next week will be our one month anniversary. I know it's nerdy, but I just wanted to say I'm so happy you came into my life. Here's to munch number two and many more to come. Full of deep conversations, long nights of stargazing, and taking just way too seriously. Uh, I guess you, the flowers worked. Dear Ivan, the Dawson Advisory Committee has reviewed your application. I'm very sorry to inform you that we are unable to offer your position to our program at this time. Was it because of the font I sent? This year we received an application of thousands of well-qualified candidates from across the Soviet Union. Please know that our decisions so say much more about the limited you know, number of positions available that they do about qualifications of any given candidate. Thank you again for your interest in the museum. We wish you the best of luck in future endeavors. Are you kidding me? Then what was the point? The most glorious days, Branch Operation Supervisor Advisors Day, here at last. All across our motherland, tireless, hardworking bosses are being honored and celebrated by adoring subordinates. Okay, all SD workers are hereby granted 20 minutes extra of the work to show their boss some appreciation and love. Don't forget to send your boss a card that he'll never forget. And after you denied my, you know, request, that jerk. 
decide what to send boss. Shoot. Uh, that or this. To my special boss on your special day, I got you this car so I could say, man, that is something. Oh, wow. Let's see. What should I send my special boss on his special day? Especially after he denied my, you know, request to attend my family reunion. And he did do a lot of things I don't exactly like. Even if I did suck up to this guy and still got my job, who's to say he's not going to kick me off for doing something wrong? He did kick off the previous HRM manager and she was with them for 40 years. And she's, and they're going to threaten people, especially after they went through loss, like the guy with the cockatoo. And they didn't tell me how fatal this guy's injury was, the Yuri guy. And I sent him a bad card and his widow was upset with me. Oh, jeez, that was bad. And I don't know if any of the cards would have worked anyway. He would still probably die and she would be mad. And I don't blame her. And she's, and they automatically picked a person the lady to, you know, do his job afterwards right away, and that was really bad. So, what I'm gonna say is, despite the whole, you know, not getting into the program and all, I quit. I quit! After all, work is always there. You can get any job you want, but you can't get is family, and that doesn't last a lifetime. You be there for your family. Okay, what sh happens? Okay, Moscow University from Dad. Hey, kiddo. It was a great game to see you and Natasha at the family reunion. At least we are still a couple. After you left, everyone was saying what a great couple you two make. Keep on the little cousin Arnhem, though. I think he has a crush on your girl. Sorry here you didn't land the museum gig. I think you would have done a docent job at it. Did I make that joke already? I don't think so. Speaking of jobs, I have some good news. I checked in with my buddy at the campus transportation department. He said they'd love to hire you. Just show up Monday to the maintenance supervisor's office, ask for Peter, and mention my name. He'll get you started with your paperwork. I know that washing vans isn't the cushiest gig, but look on the bright side. You got a new relationship, a roof over your head, and at least you're not at Agrisoft anymore. Plus, we'll be working together, dad and lad. Hey, you want to ride the bus to school with me? Love, dad. See, at least that's sweet. And I think that's it, right? Yep, here it is. From Ivan. Wow, what can I say? Designed and created by Marcy Campos, Will Campos, Sean Bucard, and Kyle Laporte. I hope I'm saying that right. Man, look at that. Images from... Oh, I see. Look at that. At least they cited where the images are from. At least that's good. Well, Muzzle Supper, here right now since basically we're done with this game. But this is all from Ivan. So tell me in the comment section of what do you think about this game? I definitely love the choices you make in this. I mean, it depends on whether you send a good card or a bad card to the person, the recipient as they say. And I think I did all of them good except for that be better one. I mean, I don't know if um, whatever card you choose will help the guy be alright. I mean, they didn't say his injuries were fatal and all and he was in that injury ward. But they didn't say what happened to him and all. They just say he was injured on the job, so. But still, I love playing this game. I mean, it actually makes you think on what card to choose and what how their reaction is to it. I mean, that whole cheerful card of the, you know, when that lady was moving, at least she wasn't offended by it. And I hope she wasn't after that. I mean, she was getting the pink slip just for after spending 40 years on the job. And at least I hope she's taking up ballet like she said she would. Or at least she wanted to before she got the job due to her uncle. And I actually got out of that stressful, you know, workplace and into washing vans. It's not exactly the best job out there, but at least it lets me get closer to my dad and it lets me get some money. Like I said before, you can get any job you want, but family will always be there for you. And remember, like, subscribe, share all your friends. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!